Do you want to install a wall mounted air condition in your room but are confused with the location of your AC? That is on which wall and exactly on which location should you mount this AC? If this is so, you are at the right place, do watch this entire video and do subscribe my channel Civil Engineering Forum. If you install AC at the wrong place, then in future you might have to suffer. This can create discomfort to the users, it can decrease the performance of your AC and can boost your electricity bills. There may be chances of short circuit and even it can have adverse effect on your health. This is why I have shown numerous tips which will help you to solve these problems. Here our tip number one is, install AC away from any heat source. In case your air conditioner is installed near any heat source where generally there is temperature higher than the normal room temperature like at near the kitchen, near exhaust, near window where there is direct sunlight incident Due to this high temperature over the localized area, your AC sensor won't sense the correct room temperature and no cutoff mode will remain on. Due to this, it will give you extra chilling effect which even will boost your electricity bills. Then tip number 2 is, install it away from electrical appliances. Sometimes people install their AC exactly above the TV unit or even electrical appliances in this way. In future, due to any technical glitch or any blockage in the water outlet, there may be water droplets falling inside or there are even chances of damp wall. Now if your AC is installed above any electrical appliances like this, there might be chances of electrical short circuit. And so we should be aware about this before installing AC on the first phase. Tip number 3 is, install it at a height of 7 to 8 feet. That is, indoor unit of the AC should be installed at the height of about 7 to 8 feet from the floor. This will give you an evenly distributed and circulated air by your AC. Sometimes people install it exactly below the slab level with no gap above. Due to this, your AC unit will not get enough warm air above to inhale and so can exhale the chilled air with the maximum efficiency. Due to this low efficiency, there will be extra electricity bills and there are even chances of your AC might even ask for the maintenance. Due to this reason, we need to place AC at least at a gap of half a feet from the slab level. Then our fourth tip is regarding wall hall. In order to connect indoor and outdoor units in a split AC, we need to drill a 4 inch diameter hole on the masonry wall. If your structure is framed structure, that is if it's made up of RCC beam and column, you need to take care that the hole you are drilling does not come on the beam as drilling the hole in any structural members might cut the reinforcement bars and may weaken it structurally. And if it is the load bearing structure, that is all the load or here we would say weight is transferred through the bricks, then you need to take care that the hole that you drill is not on the wall with the maximum openings. That is if you drill this 4 inch hole on the wall facing which has numerous doors and windows then this could be dangerous. Then tip number 5 is, don't place AC above the headboard of your bed. You should not install AC indoor unit on the upper portion of the wall to which the headboard of your bed is attached in this way. This is because due to any reason in future if there are chances of leaking water or damp wall the water might fall on the bed. Either you can install AC on the top side in this manner. Then tip number 6 is, install AC unit such that it gives us an indirect flow. As we already had a talk, installing AC such that it gives us a direct flow might create discomfort to the users and there may even be chances of some undesirable health effects like dry skin, joint pain, sore throat etc. So it is better to align indoor unit in such a way that it gives us cooling effect by indirectly cooling off the entire area of the room. And here our last tip, tip number 7 is, do not place it behind any furniture or wall that may obstruct the flow. You should not place your indoor unit behind any object like furniture which may block your flow. This is because due to this air will not be evenly circulated on the entire room and so will have to keep AC on for longer time which will even boost your electricity bills. So friends I hope this video was useful for you. If this is so just click on the like button and do subscribe my channel Civil Engineering Forum. This is all for today. Thank you for watching.